All right. I should be back. I should be back. All right. Okay. The first 24 minutes of stream is there. Uh, and so it, it did its thing. I turned it off. I turned it back on. And then I went back live again. Hopefully, fingers crossed, everything's working great. He thick boy. Yeah, I mean, yeah, the original model has its, has its thing going on. Stuck behind a Star Trek ad. <laughs> Are they advertising Star Trek Fleet Command? They have offered to sponsor me like a dozen times now. Same with Raid Shadow Legends and like a half dozen other shitty uh, mobile games. They just keep sponsoring me. Hey, you want you, you want to you want to do a thing? Want to do a thing? No, I don't. All right. This is where you select your team and review the enemy champions before each battle. Oh, some stupid TV each show. Each champion oh. has unique skills and an affinity that makes them weak or strong against another affinity. Ah, I was gonna play the uh, the other uh, treat for tonight after I got out of the tutorial. Oh, so it's it's all type based. Yeah, skull beats fire, beats lightning, beats skull. Got it. Magic beats spirit, spirit beats force, force beats magic, and void is special. Void champions have no direct weaknesses against other. Offenses. Triangles are very strong shapes. You have only two champions. Let us. All right, Archer Lady. Oh, I can't even drag them over. I have to double click. Oh yeah, let's click them in there, boys. Doesn't look like same. Well, I can see it on my end, K Dog. Uh, try refreshing the page a few times. Team center channel filter. Team power two thousand two hundred eighty-six. An arbitrary number to make me feel powerful. The arrows above each enemy's head show how your champion's affinity matches up against theirs. An affinity advantage means a more effective attack, more damage, and a higher chance to crit. Yeah, I mean, the whole, like, combat bonuses thing is not unique to this thing, but it also is very much a standard trope of video gaming and fantasy. Oh, do I actually get to like pick what to do now? Okay, uh, use the arrow on this guy. Good arrowing. Ow, he smacked her. You should wear more armor, lady. Do the do the this. Excellent this. Okay, now arrow this man. Stop hitting the the other lady. She does not wish to be struck. Look at this dungeon design, my goodness. Uh, this, the one with the guys look, look like they're dying. Do this. Oh yeah, that's, that's the, that's the money shot. Boost turn meter. Hello, troops. Oh, we got green on this one. Uh, do the lightning-y thing. Fucking Shrekt. We won. We got a sword and some silver. Elaine and sniper. Next? No, I have to click the reward. Excellent. Campaign levels drop artifacts, and here's your first. Artifacts are powerful Hello. items that boost your champion stats. The loincloths look uncomfortable and practical. Most loincloths are uncomfortable. They're there for modesty, not for comfort. Along with special items, your champions will earn XP after every No uwu throw. Earn enough and they'll uh, growing uh. strength and power. Ah! Oh no! Where's the troll? Oh, there it is. Oh, 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 oh. Oh yeah, I added a time delay on the troll a little so I would troll myself, and I definitely got myself. Damn. Ooh woo. Go Back to, to the bash, I guess. Collection and equip that artifact. All right. Where's the big glowing circle I have to click? Hey, whoa! Oh, that's the troll low triggering twice. God damn it. This is where you can view all champions under your. Each champion can equip up to six artifacts. Equip. See that? 
Your artifact you see that? Strengthened the equipment does things. Better yet, artifacts can be equipped in sets to provide special bonuses and effects. If you unlock them. I believe you are ready. Return to Karok Castle, seat of King Tabor of Karok. Fight through his banner lords. Murder his men him. to see if he's alright. know if he has succumbed to the shadow. Murder his men to see if he's alright. Okay. Chachki's avatar is the red common Saku. Oh yeah, they are. Look at that. Yeah, they were covered up by the uh, um the alien last night. A demoralizing display. This is such a phone game. There's like, I I just uh, just a big thumb smushing the button screen right now. Like that's all I got. Oh. Oh no, not sniper. She's my favorite well-developed character. Congratulations. Leveled I've leveled up. up. Every time you level up, you'll get full energy, gems. Oh, you get gems when you level up. You'll even How generous! New features. And here what? are your rewards from battle. Oh, I With got a hat. With this artifact, you'll have enough to equip a full set. Okay, let's equip a full set. Artifacts can be equipped in. Just put the hat on. Oh, she's so tanky now. Special icons will show which artifact sets a champion is equipped with. Tap on Gem the set icon to yeah. read more about which bonuses it gives to your champions. But not right now. The tutorial is up. Oh, look at that high-resolution graphics. That hair moves like it's a blob of Play-Doh. I mean, it's got a nice texture on it, but that's it. This set boosts your champion's HP by 15%. Life artifacts come in sets of two, meaning you can gain a huge 45% A huge 45% bonus. Let's upgrade this artifact and improve its bonus. Doesn't show your character wearing a hat. Oh, I can upgrade them. Oh, okay. Ah, using that silver. Oh, yeah, look at that. It's so good. Let's do it again. Oh, it's unstoppable. Yes, spend that silver. Excellent Are we done? Work. When you upgrade artifacts to certain levels, they gain new substats, giving your champions an even ah, bigger boost. One percent critical damage. Can I do it again? No. You gave me fifty thousand silver, and you're like, don't use the silver. You have learned well. Keep strengthening your warriors. I shall return in time to teach you more. Leave me alone. Oh my god, what did I click? What did I click? Starter pack? Oh yeah, 40 bucks Canadian. Would you like some shards? Some bonus XP? 500 gems? A tavern thing? Go away. It's already asking me for money. There's a referral program? Oh my god, it gets six rents to play and you can get this shit. I thought... So just anyone can fire up a referral program thing? Oh shit. Daily login rewards. Ah, gotta get on the daily reward grind. 20k silver. Just for logging in on one day. 500 energy? Okay, so, I mentioned this before when I was doing the, some Dark Elf taste. Easy, easy. Um, daily login rewards feel like a nice boost. Like a, hey, oh, hey, look at that. I get a nice little free thing. But really, it's a psychological trick designed to make you think that you are uh, enjoying the game more than you actually are. Because the the marketing strategy for a gotcha game is hook, hobby, habit. They have a hook, some some good little trailer, some, some interesting character, some premise that hooks you. And then you try it out. And when you're leveling quickly and the rewards are still interesting, you build a hobby out of it. And then because you want to keep cashing those daily rewards, because your energy supply is limited, you have to come back periodically to play to keep your energy bar empty, it becomes a habit. 
and it begins to exploit people with more addictive personalities. People more likely to fall into a cycle of addiction fall into this. And for the casual player and people who don't have addictive personalities, they can just pick it up, put it down whenever. This doesn't affect them. But people who are vulnerable get exploited by this shit. I played FGO for two and a half years. Uh, every day. At least three times a day. So that my energy bar never got full. Wow, they just keep throwing more, more, more offers. Buy something. Free rewards. Let's see what the free rewards are. Oh, look, axe, shield, and beer. Cool. New episode. The other thing that these things do is they have a lot of stuff going on, so you feel really busy, even though most of it's just busy work. That's a, that's a thing they do. Anyways, with the tutorial finished, we're going to step out again. Step back. Action Shield Beer are my favorites. Exactly. Um, but yeah, K-Dog, you see STO. I'm, that's Star Trek Online for people who don't know. Uh, working for your dailies, same mental trap. Uh, if it's something you, you can only get once a day and they make you play it every day, that is still in the habit-forming phase. It is designed to get people to feel like they have to play rather than just playing because they want to play. And like I said, some people, it's pick it up, put it down, it doesn't affect them. But the people who are vulnerable to exploitative prog or behavior, it can become a real problem for them. At least the rewards. It doesn't matter if the rewards are good or not. It's about forming the habit. Anyways, before I d dive too deeply into the psychology of it, I have a little treat for you. I have a little treat for you guys. As we all know, I'm doing while the bell's away, the senpai will play for a little while here while Bell is back in America. But Bell has a thing going on too when she gets back. And we are going to be debuting. We're gonna be the we're gonna be the first ones to see a little promo for that. So we'll bring up the display capture. Coming this summer. A new My volume is bad. Coming this summer, a new Bell outfit splashes onto the scene as she tries to conquer her greatest fear. New games, new redeems, new penalties, all with a whole new look. Coming for your viewing pleasure in late July. Don't miss it. It's going to be a good summer. Get hype with that business. Yes. Bell has some new stuff coming. And it's going to be a good time. Look forward to that. I'll probably run that again later this stream just cuz it's just cuz it's cool. Uh I she got I I was I was allowed to do the uh the uh, voiceover for that. Uh and the the uh the video was edited by the lovely uh Goodnight Snack. So keep an eye out for uh, more details on that on Belle's Twitter, her Discord, uh, wherever else she feels like uh, announcing it. She might just scream it out of the window one day. So yes, sweet. <laughs> that has a voice actress. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take it easy. All right, let's keep delving into this psychological trap here. Um, I have another thingy, so why not do this? Hello, join my army, please. Random hero of questionable quality. Hey, didn't you guys just say you want some more Dark Elf titties? Uh, I believe we have just acquired some. They are an attack type hero. The Mage Killer. Roger, they have skins? Oh. I have no shards left. Dark Elf titties. Alright, yeah. Quests? Oh. Summon three champions. So yeah, here's another daily quest, right? So you have to do four tasks and you can get some gems, which are, I'm assuming, the premium currency. Uh, do achievements give things? They better, yeah, you better believe. Connect your account, enable notification. I enabled notifications. Ugh, I'll have to fix that later. Oh, I leveled up just from collecting achievements. Cool. Increase my max energy. Weekly achievements? Oh my god. Monthly achievements? Claim the reward for completing all daily quests 30 times. Are you serious? 
Advanced unlocks level 35. Yeah. They want you to use this every single... What is this timer here for? Yeah, they're just giving me things. I have done nothing. Here, I'll get another hero. Okay, I guess I guess we're playing Dark Elves. Thank you for the hydrate. Champion lore. <laughs> cool. Thanks, Ranger. You go to Yeah, well this is a very common setup. I've played other games like this. And the, the things that all unlock at certain levels and the multiple tasks in multiple places, places all have very... It, it's very much a standard design. There's something free in the shop. Let's... Uh, I'll take a free gift, sure. Thanks. Uh, did I get my free gift? Oh, I have platinum points, don't I? Didn't I get some points from somewhere? Here's another thing they do. Here's another thing. Multiple currencies. You can't just spend your money to get a thing. If they give you multiple different currencies and kind of obfuscate which ones are worth more and which ones are worth less, it makes it easier for them to like sell you something that's obviously a bad deal, but you're not sure it is because the currencies are all jumbled together. Like uh, like these platinum points. I don't know what they're worth. Uh, does spending this money earn me the platinum points? Ah, yeah, look at that. You can spend your, your gems here, or cash, and receive platinum points. The gem shop, you buy energy, shards. It's all designed to obfuscate what you're actually spending. It's it's designed to be obtuse. Yeah, look at, look at, the, fucking 140 bucks. 4.5 million silver. Thank goodness we got that 50 silver at the start. Holy shit. Alright. Do I have anything else in here? I, did I grab any more things? Fragment summon. Oh. This guy looks like a Dark Souls boss. Oh, this must be the mercy system. Uh, you collect fragments from, like, burning heroes or getting duplicates. And then you can turn them in for guaranteed summons. Fusions? My god goodness all right the mine children yearn for the mines news attack chase our attack chase oh hey we got some boots and then like you get the guy at the end oh yeah look at this guy his name is our he has boots look at this high resolution model he ha his skull is blindfolded he has skins? He doesn't have skins. He's legendary though. Look at this legendary man. Alright, let's go to the let's go continue the story. Where's the story again? Oh, someone threw champions. Better grab that real quick. Oh, I summoned a spirit champion. Yeah, okay. Uh summon a force champion? Summon a magic champion? Oh yeah, give me all the... Just give me all the clicks. I want to click things. This game is designed to make you want to click things. Skyrim's better looking characters. Oh, progressive reward. Yeah, they're all progressive. High elves? This must be uh, Eleanor, or whatever her name is. Yeah, Elaine. Hello, Elaine. She's rare. Also, look at the stack up here of the, the types. Three uncommon, four, eight, twelve rare, thirteen epic, and eight, fifteen legendary. That bell curve is messed up. We should have some dark elves, right? The corrupted, the union dwarves, shadowkin. Oh my god, there's like four bagrillion heroes to collect. 
Yeah, look at this. 16, 20 legendary, dif different legendary heroes. 18 epic. 14 rare, 3 uncommon, and 3 common. I thought you liked Bell's Curves. Bell's Curves are very nice, but I'm talking about the, the distribu distribution of loot here. It happened in FGO as well. There, the number of common and regular heroes you could summon from the friend point summon never expanded, but they just kept adding more and more 5 stars, more and more 5 stars, because those are the ones you can make money off of. So you end up with this bizarre distribution of, of stuff. All right, so we'll put the axe and uh, shield. Uh, no, I don't want to upgrade. I want to equip. Does that give her a set bonus? Yeah, it does. Look at that. Offensive bonus. Sniper will be shooting very hard now. Uh, and you. You have some boots. Heals 30% of damage dealt. Oh, we're going to... Hold on. So, in my bit, I joked about um, the, your build being limited by what gear you get. And that's pretty obvious here, right? I want this person to do this. Well, good luck getting the gear to do that. Oh, artifacts, glyphs, skins, lore, reviews. Oh, there's a system for people to talk about things in-game. That's actually pretty good. Alright. Alright, let's... Are we done clearing notifications? Why does the index still have notifications? Is it because I didn't click Elaine? Hey, hey, hello, Elaine. Oh. Adjudicator. Elaine. Does she have skins? No. Who the fuck has skins, then? Please stop having notifications. All right. Where is the... Oh, God, there's a notification up here, too. Oh, free gifts! Yes, please, give me all the gifts. I have 200,000 silver already. 200,000 silver. Yes, the in-game rating system is super helpful. That way, if you roll a hero, you can just check and people are like, they're shit. And then you don't level them. You don't waste your time. Uh, no, no, no. Cancel. I'm, I'm going to hang around for a bit. Don't worry. What's up here? Player info? I'm fine with the generic. You know what? I'll be an old, a grumpy old man. There we are. Confirm. Achievement complete! Oh, guys, we just completed an achievement. What did I get for it? Another 20k silver. And I leveled up! <laughs> we made it to level 4 without doing anything other than tutorial and clicking notifications. Do I have to look at every single one of these to make the notification go away? Also, from business class, the color of notifications is specifically chosen in a, in a manner to make them more likely to be clicked. Facebook measured the, the, the time it takes people to click a notification, whether the notification was blue, green, or red. And whichever one made people click the notification faster was the one they stuck with. Because it's all about monopolizing your time. Oh, I can turn down this music finally. Uh, hello? There we go. I got the, got the synth wave on now. Raid Sponsible Shadow Pie Legends. I don't know if I can change my name. Oh no, there it is. Raid. Okay. Raid. Sponsible. Shadow Pie 
Legends. Confirm. It's too long. That's going to be more than 14, isn't it? Dang. 14 is not a lot. Raid Pie. Legends? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 12. Yeah, okay. Achievement unlocked. You're right. We got another achievement. How much silver can we get for that? Another 20k! See what I mean when I said silver is a meaningless currency? It's just going to stack up. We're going to have fucking 15 million of it. We have 110 out of 27 energy. I don't even know where I go to play the play the game anymore. What button was that? Battle? Yeah, it's battle. Okay. Let's let's do some more let's do some more thrilling gameplay. Uh, can I have more team? I can't have more team. What about my other I want I want more people. I'm allowed to have 4, aren't I? Whatever, start. Are gemstones currency too? Yeah, they are. Uh, is there an... Yeah, here we go. Just auto. Anyways. So. I don't think it's possible to die in this part. Here's the thing. You could get a brand new hero, like some legendary hero. And if you check the chat and he's good, uh, you'd still have to go back and level them up. I'm sure there's like XP potions you can like buy or whatever but jeepers this reminds me of the Don Machi uh, gacha game I don't know if any of you care about Don Machi but it's set in a vaguely fantasy world with RPG mechanics and uh yeah, it had this kind of send the team into the dungeon and they fight their way through the clouds of enemies or whatever. Uh, oh, I got a shield. Oh, yeah, fucking shield. Next. Start. Um, yeah, auto stays on. What's this info button do? Cool. Double speed. Oh, we're going to speed run this game now. Who are these people? Why are we killing them? Why does nobody have names? We leveled up. That's all that matters. New champion. We got the Crusader. Look at him. He's got a very edgy sword. What a boy. Silver is energy credits. Gems is dilithium. Platinum is Endeavor XP. I wonder if there's a currency for cosmetics too, like gold press platinum. You never know. Uh, welcome to the team, buddy. You're an ugly man in a hat. I probably won't use you. Next. Although you are two stars and you're higher level, you're, oh, hey, we can actually have three people here. Uh, you're in charge. You're here. You? No. You? She is a skull. Skull is probably fine. Start. I made sure they were all archers again. Yeah. Would you rather playing this? I would rather do this than getting over it. Do you see there's a new getting over it game? Uh, it's called uh, Just Up or Only Up or something like that. Fucking uh, Moist Critical was playing it. It's just some frustrating platformer kind of thing. Oh, we might actually lose someone here. Oh, no. Fight harder! Oh. We've traded in Dark Elf titties for Dark Elf butt. To come to terms with? I mean, maybe. We leveled up again. Yay! Oh, Ranger didn't do so well. <gasps> we got a shard! Back to the map, guys! We got a shard! Oh, what? Oh, would you like to spend some money? No thanks. I don't want to throw $70 into this game. 
Send me your energy! Please be another dark elf. Oh, boring man in hats. Pilgrim. Alright. <sighs> what even? Anyways, I'd rather play Genshin than this. Genshin isn't a bad game. Yes, it has gotcha in it. But... It has gameplay. Like, this one doesn't really have gameplay. I mean, yeah, we'll have to gear our guys up eventually if we have the right gear. Um, if, we actually, if we want to play this game well, whatever the fuck that means. But yeah, it's not like, oh, we got some gameplay here, you know? There we go. Does she have a, she have a life bonus now? There you go. Good job, Ranger. With your little tummy tattoo. The Genshin characters look good. Yeah, I mean... Yeah, Genshin looks good. I mean, it's, this game isn't, like, built to be amazing. It's built to get money out of whales. Let's be honest here. It, it's here for the whales. Let's, uh... Yeah. What do we get? Accuracy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I've got accuracy, eh, boys? Let's upgrade the shield, too. Let's see what that... We got the silver to spare. What do we get? Defense. Oh, we're rolling in dough now. Actually, where's... uh You, the, the one I gave the good shit to. Can I upgrade these? Yeah. It already has two things on it. Wait, what, what level is this? Oh, it's getting expensive. And the whales are here for the booba? Exactly, the whales are here for the booba. We know who the whales are. Wait, upgrade chance? Upgrade chance? <laughs> upgrade chance oh that is awful let's keep upgrading upgrade chance certain yeah it gets lower every time it's a good thing I have a quarter million silver whales have a lot of spare toys yeah but no whales is a derogatory term used by mobile game developers to refer to people who are easily addicted and thus exploitable the, the, their community is divided into minnows, dolphins, and whales. Minnows spin nothing. They don't give a fuck about minnows. If you're happy, if you're sad, they don't care about you. Fuck you. Uh, if you're a dolphin, you're going to spend a little bit every now and then. Uh, and that's okay for them. They're okay with that. But in the long term, they, they're not too concerned about the dolphins either. Because they know the whales are going to get committed. And they're going to play and pay forever they're just gonna keep sinking money and keep sinking money and keep sinking money and they own them essentially they don't have they don't have a choice they're they're addicted whales are there to be exploited all right we did some upgrading do you feel good i don't feel good hold on what's this what's this oh yeah oh, we played for 40 minutes we got a lesser arcane potion oh yeah we're gonna have oh yeah 11 minutes for our next rewards oh Oh, I feel so rewarded. Do you, feel, do you guys feel rewarded? We can do dungeons now. Is there a low-level dungeon? Spirit Keep. What what item drops? They drop shards. This is going to be brutally difficult, isn't it? Oh, a squad of five. All right, let's put you here. Uh, and then we'll send... And... Now, this guy has a cool sword. He can go. All right. Boss guide. Oh, let's fight the boss. Rather play fake Genshin or fake hand order. Genshin, as I said, we mentioned before. Also, welcome, Jaguar. Uh, yes, Genshin. Genshin uh, has some gameplay and has some has some story to it. 
Uh, and FGO has a beloved franchise behind it. Yes, both would be more interesting than this. But the point here tonight is this is unsponsored. And we are allowed to say how miserable and awful and exploitative this game is. Auto play, double speed. I'm not here to click buttons. This game will play itself. I hope. Oh no, not Mark. Oh shit, we're going down. Oh, we're all frozen. Oh no! The dungeon's opened up and we're not strong enough to go there. However, will we do this? However, will we survive? Grind, my friend. Grind. It's so close to my cells here. Yeah, I'm like, I'm leaning in a lot. I need to take it easy. I guess the aquatic metaphor is some sort of remora. Ah! Oh. Oh shit, yeah, look at this. This is some serious business. I also didn't think we'd make, make it to the boss. Time to die! Oh, we actually killed one of them. Night. Uh, back to the Bastion. You get XP from failing? And money. Okay. It's impossible to lose at this game. Have you seen the new Fate game trailer that just dropped 30 minutes ago? Is that the Fate Extella um, trailer or the Fate Extra? Because I know there's something regarding, regarding both of those that's coming soon. Uh, and I, I, am, I am interested in both. Fate Samurai Remnant. That one I have not heard of. It's a new game. Ooh. Only one star? We gotta fix that. We gotta get all our stars in. Is Astolfo in it? Oh, please stop. Astolfo, not that interesting. Astolfo is all meme, no substance. Friendly fella. Good role in Fate uh, Apocrypha. Is Jalter and Musashi. Ah. Okay, I see who they're tapping into. I was there for the Jolter Madness on uh, FGO. I watched someone sell a truck for thousands of dollars and spend all of it to get an NP5 Jolter. No Taiga. Ah. Err, did we get three stars in this one? I don't even know. Did I? I don't know. Two stars. Well, how do I get stars? Stop asking me for money. Is that like a hard mode? Oh my goodness, there's a hard mode. Two or fewer champions, no losses. Ah, okay. So if I put you back, uh, are you guys going to be strong enough to do this on your own? Let's try. Let's, let's do this. Imagine a fake game, but with swords, but not Taiga. Taiga's cool, but, I mean, Fate has so many interesting characters, they gotta pick and choose, otherwise it just ends up a disorganized mess. I can't imagine such a thing. Uh, Fate is, um, historical figures as waifus and husbandos, uh, often fighting for the fate of the universe. Oh, stun, stun bad. I know like stun. No, I needed her alive for the star. Okay, they both level up. Replay. We have energy to spare. Why not? Taiga is the sword master. I mean... Taiga's okay. She's no... Literally any saver. But yeah, FGO just did such a huge... Uh, expansion of the characters. That... It's kind of... Kind of blows my mind. It's like, how... How do they pick and choose? Can you not focus her down? I need I need her alive at the end of this mission. Damn it. Oh, level up again. Cool. Tavern unlocked. Let's go to the tavern. This is the tavern. The main place where you upgrade and improve your champions. 
I know I think we've gone Fate Zero. Yeah, Fate Zero was, um, like, midway through the Fate release schedule, Fate lifespan, whatever you want to call it. Um, and it was written by, uh, um, not, not Asiga. Uh, ah, Gen, Gen Uroboshi, yeah, the Uro Butcher. Uh, which is fine for a Fate series, because most of the characters have to die to get anywhere anyways. You can sacrifice weaker champions to gain XP and level up quickly. Ah. Leveling up increases a champion's stats, making their skills... Okay. Hey, Pilgrim. What? No. Cancel. I... No. Upgrade rank? When a champion hits the maximum level for their rank, you need oh. to upgrade to upgrade. It's the an ascension rank. system. You need to sacrifice champions or chickens. Champions or rank. chickens. The number of champions you need to sacrifice depends on the rank. Chickens. Okay. Stop asking me for money. The mushroom got isekai to the FGO. Hmm. Can you eat this hero for XP? Oh, you can. Uh, hey, Ranger, do you want to eat a Pilgrim? Oh, yeah. Destroy this Pilgrim. Uh, consume him for energy. There we go. Uh, what's this do? XP barrel. Highest level possible for their level and rank cancel um elaine boom level 30 this will be easy now wait no apply oh it costs five hundred thousand silver uh-huh okay all right i see i see what you did there game guess what i do not know uh, the mushroom got isekai into FGO. Not joking. Mushroom zones of servant and joined FBO. I stopped following FGO when I stopped playing the game, uh, mostly to protect myself from uh, from the effects of Gacha. Um. So yeah, I I I I know there's lots of stuff happening, and every now and then Bell will uh, will show me something from FGO when she when she picks it up again uh, and I'm like that's cool I please don't be that cool I I don't want to die and yet I'm still here yeah I'm this is an awareness stream I'm not this game is getting uninstalled the second stream is over don't worry I'm not gonna hang around and play fucking raid shadow legends even if I wanted to play a uh, gotcha I'd play a good gotcha to suffer worse than FGO a couple of hours for a lark why you gotta call me out like this here you have. Yeah. Can okay, I can I just give you two of them? Yeah, there we go. Okay, now we're gonna absolutely bop this dungeon. Look at you, you're so strong. You're so strong. Oh, we gonna play oh there's tons of stuff to upgrade, isn't there? Skills? Upgrading skills is the oh, key hi, to yeah. maximizing a champion's effectiveness. Upgrade. You can upgrade a champion skills in two ways, either by sacrificing duplicate champions uh, okay. or by using skill tomes. And not a funny joke, yay! Skill tomes come in three different rarities. Epic skill tomes can upgrade uncommon, common. Epic and legendary skill tomes are extremely rare. I have no tomes, doesn't matter. Rank. Ascension, you can ascend wow. champions by using potions to unlock new skills. And a champion's ascension level is indicated by the number of purple stars. Purple stars. Ooh. Ascension. A rank four champion can be ascended four times, while a rank three champion, the type of potion needed to ascend a champion. Ah, we got that potion. There we go. Okay, I, I see. I see. Stop asking me for money! Okay, we're fine. Everything's fine. Hey, we have money. All right, we have we have things again. Oh boy, oh boy, who we get this time? 
Ah, uh, Breacher. Cool, let's do it again. Oh, hi, look at you, uh, a barbarian elder. Neat. Gotta catch them all! Ridiculous. Oh yeah, let's check the index. Hello, preacher. What's your lore? Shrouded by mist. Damn. We'll never know what they're about. I bet the elder... I bet the elder has a great... Wait. Oh shit, the elder's rare. Shrouded by mist again. Skins? No, no skins. Didn't think we'd actually get something good out of the gacha. What do you know? Give me my goods. Give me my goods. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Need 20k more silver in 30 minutes, guys. We'll have 20k more silver in 30 minutes. Oh my god. Oh yeah, we're gonna bring a little. Oh, you guys are in trouble. You're in trouble now. Survived the hit. That was irritating. I'm gonna be really annoyed if she still goes down. She, what? How? She she had she was so strong, and she still almost died. What are the stars? Two or fewer champions, no losses. I guess. Uh, where's that new piece of clothing? Oh, we got two of them. Cool. Equip. Uh, and you're here too? Yeah, you put that on too. In fact, let's, let's, let's knock out a few upgrades on this thing too. Boop. 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 Cool, got some defense on it. We're surviving and thriving now, guys. Look at us go. You had to pee and we're reminded of something. Sure. Well, you're in luck. Ah, pee joke. I think we'll be fine. Oh, shield. Are we in trouble? These level fours are going to hassle us. This is nothing like the tutorial. Never mind, we leveled up. We're fine. Okay. Oh, shit. He's level 10. Two or fewer champions, no losses. Ah, uh, about that. Can I go back to town? Yeah, um, here. You. Uh, eat. Eat the preacher. Yeah. Consume that bitch. Goodbye. So I was in a hedge during drought. No, you were in another stream just lurking. All right, all right. Just enjoying the ambiance. So, speaking of which, I hope everyone else is enjoying the ambiance. Just chilling while we uh, rip on this game. It costs silver to take off armor? Fucking <laughs> what? Okay, alright, I'm fine, I'm fine. I'm fine. We're fine, we're doing great. 
And the silver shoe drops. Yeah, exactly, right? What the... What even? All right, let's go. He's level 10. We're like level 13 and 16. We'll be fine. Why are you still alive, old man? All right, boss fight. Watch this epic combat. Oh no, he stabbed us from the sky. Keep shooting him. His shit's on cooldown anyways. Wow, Having overcome tough. the castle guard, the company leader called to mind how the banner lords had cried out their allegiance to their king, but also to Seroth. Come check. Oh, someone was doing the shameless self promotion? Brutal. Oh, by the way, if you want to watch more shameful anime business, this is the place for that. Was the king's warring folly prompted by the will of the Lord of the Darkness? The Lord of Darkness has summoned you to become his minion in the first dungeon. You will be killed repeatedly by novice adventurers, dropping loot to fuel their strength. Upon interrogation, a fallen knight confessed that the king had not been seen at the castle for many a month. His orders were being relayed by messenger from his encampment on the Eastern Front. And that's why we have to go to the sewers next. This meant only one thing. The company would have to pass through the war-torn city of Arnak. Arnak. Oh, hello, war priest. You're rare. Nice. And your support. Oh my god, some support. She has a chalice. Hey, Jolene. Coming to catch some sun? Yeah, it's getting low in the sky. It's getting harder and harder to find sun to lay in, eh? Here, you come down. You can lay down on the couch if you want. Good cat. So, well, he did call himself an alpha male, which automatically makes him pathetic. Uh, so I don't blame the chat for, for dunking on him. Mission complete. Uh, collect. Yeah. Holy shit, look at this guy. Holy shit, look at this guy. He has so many skills. He's a lizard man? He's a lizard badass. Except for the fact that... Is that the Protoss hairpiece? And like a Zamitsi headdress? All these design elements, more I look at them, feel like they're from something else just mashed together. Like those gauntlets feel kind of Skyrim-y. And those shoulder pads feel a little wowish. And he's bare chest that I just realized. The amount this alpha male is getting shot. Of course! You're supposed, if someone calls himself an alpha male, you laugh at them. Stop asking me for money. New tournament position, 41. What's this? This is, oh, this is the thing you're asking. Yeah, you're asking me for money. All right, can't go away. Well, who's the new fella? Or the woman? Yeah, this is war, so, war, oh yeah, war priest. Is, does her posture seem weird to you? Like, I'm used to females in games standing a little weird, but her ribs don't feel like they're lined up with her hips. Like, they're trying a little too hard to, like, boop the hip out, uh, that they forgot how spines work. Despite the fact that she's about, she's got that bonk stick ready to bonk hard. The Skyrim scaled armor? Yeah, he kind of did. Crazy. So what's what's this system that's been thrown at me now? Uh game? Is this the PvP? Oh, claim the reward. Yeah, give me that full energy juice. Five shards for fifty whatevers. I'm not no, we're not doing any My on-screen chat isn't updating. Uh, you're on that message just appeared there. Okay, it sorted itself out. C 
cool. I guess we'll just keep fighting. Uh, no, we should, we should try that dungeon again. Yeah, let's try the dungeon again. Now, this is a spirit dungeon, right? So fiery bits should be good, right? And spirit beats Marshall. Whatever, we'll just go. Who cares? Beat the Minotaur to earn scrolls. That first round is pretty easy. After that, it gets less easy. Good job, Mr. Crusader. 32 mini nukes now. Wow, that's... You're... Oh, whoops. You're well armed. Are we actually going to do this? I mean, all the fodder I brought is just dead, but we out-level her and there's two of us. Did you stop revitalizing P? I don't know what that means and I'm uncomfortable talking about P. Oh. Damn, bitch, you gotta heal. Rip. Level up off of dying. Clans unlocked. Okay, we're gonna skip clans. I don't have. I don't want anyone I know to. No, we're not. Okay. We got a thousand silver for dying. Level ten pack. Would you like to pay for a level ten pack? Leave me alone. Tap here for combat tips. Have you tried equipping artifacts? I have. Oh, we got new artifacts. We got shoes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's upgrade these boots. Give me the fancy boots. Give me some dancing shoes. Yeah, I think she passed. Yeah, her pee revitalizes her. And she constantly pees. Wait, where is this offensive set coming from? Do I have that? Where you, you you have the offensive set, right? I have this whole set just lying around. That was expensive. So yeah, she has she has some attack boost now. Good job, sniper. You're supposed to be deadly. Um, a weapon and a shield. Some boots. Oh, he has pierced nipples. Ugh. Uh, this woman, however, uh, we, we might bring her along because she has healy bits. Um, lifesteal. Uh, maybe some HP. Or st HP? I don't know. So you are tanky. You are shooty. Uh, we'll bring you along and you can be tanky as well, I guess. Equip. Now we have the two attack artifacts. And I think we can give them to her. Yeah, yeah, we'll equip this. Swap that out and we'll equip this. There we go. And then the shield we can give to the cleric. There you go, so now she has the thing there. So we got our three elves and our cleric all ready to go. And Captain Pierce Nipples gets nothing. P 
Pierce nipples are weird. Healy bits equals titties, maybe. Let's do woman ye. HP best for support, indeed. Hello! Kiriod? Kirod? Kiroid? Kiroid? Welcome, welcome, and thanks for dropping by. Welcome to the legendary unsponsored stream, where we played Raid, Lad Raid Shadow Legends and complained about all the bad stuff it has. <gasps> Hello, Jolene. Coming to check out on me again? Yeah, I'm talking loud tonight. Yeah. Our chill vibe is massively decreased. As we point out shady business practices, you're going to sit right in front of the screen? That's okay. Good kitty. Good kitty. You sit wherever you want. I can't... I don't know if... I'm, one, two, three, four. We'll 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 hold on that for now. Let's go to the tavern and level up. Uh, stop asking me for money. <laughs> ah! All right. Uh, you, you may consume Mr. Barbarian. Oh yeah, eat his soul. What do you? What's he worth? Five levels. Eat him. Done. Consumed. All right. That'll give you a head start on leveling up. Uh, oh, did we finish a challenge? Yeah. 10k silver just for equipping a support type with a defense boost. Uh, Jolene, you're you're blocking my screen. It's fine. I don't need to see what's going on. You gonna merp for the stream? Merp? Merp? Oh yeah. You miss Bell, don't you? It's okay. It's okay. She'll be back. Oh, we can summon again. Give me the crap. Hello. Common Thrall. Knight's Revenant. Okay. Stop asking me for money. What faction even is he? He's probably... Ah, Knight's Revenant, that makes sense. Yeah, 17 legendaries. 16, 21 uh, epic. 13 rare. 3 uncommon and only 1 common. What's his lore? Shrouded by mists. What a surprise! To the tavern. Our priestess is going to eat the zombie. Hello. Yeah, you coming down to the couch? Yeah, you come down to the couch. You get comfy. All right, Julie. Uh, was that the first or second Hunter x Hunter? Uh, because I only watched the, the the first one. I never watched the reboot or the remake. There you go. Good job, War Priest. Eat that zombie. All right. Just random rewards. I have 417 out of 45 energy. They really want you to keep playing that first day. The first time you play, they want you to get really far in so you feel like you've gotten a lot. Ah, uh, because then when you come back and it start, they start rationing out, you know, first one's free kind of deal. That's when they start really squeezing you. All right. To the sewers of Anorak. The once glorious to city of Arnok had fallen into ruin. Maybe in the reboot, yeah. And great sorrow. But I do remember some heart ripping out from uh, uh, Hunter x Hunter. Peopled by desperate refugees, it had become an unclean place made darker by unknown horrors spawned in the encroaching shadow. Did you just imply refugees make a place unclean? To go Maybe. through it safely would take days. To go around it much longer. So the company agreed to pass beneath it. They would venture into the foul city sewers, albeit risking the known danger of intruding on the territory of the lizard men. Hey, some lizard boys. Oh, wow, there's a lot of them. Oh, we could get like a legendary, a rare lizard man. Look at this guy. He's got some low poly feathers out of his back and some elbow blades and... Yeah, look at him. He's he, he he fast, boy. Two or fewer champions, no losses. Uh no. You're in charge. Well, 
Let's start leveling. Sewer is always the best place to travel. I know, right? Why go through a city when you can go under it? Those are not healthy looking dogs. Also, you, that water. Bonk. Hey, Healy Lady, when are you going to heal someone? Actually, no one looks hurt. Is she healing them already? Never mind, everybody's dead. Random axe. What is, oh, wait, what's this? This is a new thing. Tournament points. Alright, next. Beat stage, beat stage, no losses, two fewer champions. Okay, I thought maybe these would be like dynamic quest, quest goals. They're not. Next. The water's green, not brown. Hey! Yeah, that's kind of gross and weird. Having the heroes and loot drop off the missions reminds me of Ozzer Lane. Uh, because I remember playing Ozzer Lane. I managed to... I ground out the one level that drops, um... Kaga and Akagi. No, Kaga and... The two carrier girls. I've played that mission like a bajillion times. Uh, so I could get those two boats. And then I never even used them. Oh wow, these are some thick looking boys. Uh, fortunately, we just keep getting stronger, so let's go. Dungeon Diver going two points for... I oh, okay. Cool, we managed to randomly start during an event. These guys don't feel like lizards. They feel more like murlocs or like something more aquatic. Can you stop stacking buffs? Hey, she healed. But also, our enemy, they reveal. But the items we will see. Hey, level up! Dungeons unlocked. Didn't we already do a dungeon like twice? Skip. Ah, we found Lizard Man Skinner. Uh, now all we need is Lizard Man Chalmers and we can reenact steamed hams in game. Um, heal lady. Uh, I need to go to the tavern and feed you a hero. Hey, Lizard Man. Become destroyed. Delicious, thank you. New tournament position, 34th. What? Stop asking me for money! <laughs> okay, so we have some attack up items we could we could swap in here. I think we'll give Mage Killer these new items. Hey, can I have $5? It's a steam temp. Exactly, right? Is, there, is your kitchen on fire? No, that's the Aurora Borealis. Localized entirely in your kitchen. At this time of year. May I see it? No. There was like this weird AI generated steamed hams that ran on Twitch for like 24 hours. You can see some of the highest level ones, like some of the best random shit on uh, YouTube. It's, it's bizarre. Ch uh, fucking uh, Skinner like calling out for the assistance of God as his house, house burns down. It's, it's insane. Cool, all right. Uh, so that, that one's ready to go in as our fifth when we finally get five. Cool. Uh, no no red dots anywhere? We're good? All right, battle. Um, campaign. Back to the sewers of Anorak. Oh, they're level eight now. They're getting tougher. 
I, we might feed uh, Sword Boy to someone too for our levels. <clears throat> so here's the thing. My gamer instincts are kicking in. And I was like, mm, the auto mode isn't terribly efficient. We should save our AoE attacks for different waves than the first one. But I also don't want to interact with that much. I just want to hang out and just be like, yeah, look at this game play itself. It's basically a screensaver. Does Canada use euros? No, we use dollars. Canadian dollars. Just ask Belle how colorful and delightful our money is. Oh, we got some gloves now. Nice. Next. Oh, they're, oh, they're leveling up. They're leveling up. We might have to stop and do some leveling. Start. It's Monopoly money. Yeah, right? It's all nice and colorful. Not like that green mess American money is. You can tell immediately what each each bill is. No shenanigans. It's our money gay. Wow. We got a shark we can summon again. Aren't you excited? Tell me you're excited. Let's get another guy. Look at that animation. Hey, it's Sister Militant. She has one skill. Wide swing. Guess who's getting fed to an elf? Oh, you weren't even worth that much experience. Why can't anyone eat the the knight? Can you eat the knight? No. You've reached maximum level for this rank? What? What? Oh. Your max level is 10? At this rank? What? Oh, I just have to unlock the champion. Okay. Uh, yeah, I can feed him to whoever I want. Goodbye, fella. It's because she's a one-star hero. This is my excited face. You're jealous of my co colored money? Yeah. You're excited? Why? So we can look at how bad this game is? So I need something to level this hero up. I guess we'll... Chickens! That's right! Ch chickens were a thing in this game. We can feed her chickens to level her up. Baz bazonkers. Wow. Oh, we finished a quest. Maybe this will give us something useful. Oh, XP. Look at that. Lock a champion. I think I can do that. No, I want to lock this champion. Wait, 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 wait. All right, we, we locked the champion. Quest complete, 20,000 silver. Locking a champion, changing, a, changing your username. Those are worth 40% of the new player signup bonus. What? Even. I'm not feeding anyone the mage killer. The mage killer is going to be part of our core team. It's going to be femme fatales. We can lock them from this screen too. 
Actually, made sure. Let's see what the reviews are like. 3.6. She's not doing great. You, 3.7. 4.5, 4.4, 4.8, not bad, not bad. Femme Fatale team. Oh, we have gloves? We have, oh, we have, we have attack gloves. Who gets the gloves? You get the gloves. Remember, it costs money to take equipment off. All right, yeah, whenever we get another stone, we'll roll again and see... Wait, wait what's this? What do we get here? <gasps> 20,000 silver just for being logged in for 90 minutes. That remember, that's 40% of the new player sign-up bonus. 50,000 silver sounds like a lot of money, but it's not. This is a new icon. What's this now? Oh, it's just more asking me for money. Please, look at this. Please, she prays. Just give some money to the company. They'll stop abusing my elvish people. Thank you for checking our game and playing it. Who knows? I mean, they can't possibly be watching all the content they pay people to play. There's no way. I could have I could have actually gone into a sponsorship program and and possibly played this game legit. Uh, and they would have been like, here's your money. Not that anyone would sign up to play a base on the stream. You need like 20 signups to get any money out. And I don't want you guys to sign up to something shitty like this just to give me money. If you really want to give me money, just give me money. Also, don't give me money. Keep your money for yourself. Don't play Raid Shadow Legends. No one deserves this. There are way, way more better games of this variety for you to play if you can safely play them without being affected by gacha addiction do not do not play gacha games if you are vulnerable to gacha addiction don't it's bad they'll get you how much are they pay me uh, nothing you need 20 signups for it to matter Al albertier albertier 67 reviews yeah he's kind of shit guess where you're going buddy to the tavern, an elf's gonna eat you. He's got a little wooshy icon. What's the wooshy icon? Do I care what his wooshy icon is? No, I don't. Um, a hey, mage killer. You want to eat a? You want to eat a guy? Can we use to fuse another champion? Oh. Oh, this is that fusion deal, isn't it? Where is that? Fusion. Champion vaults. Oh. The fusion had to be around here somewhere, right? How much are they going to pay me? I mean, nothing. That's, yeah. No. Fusions. Where was that? Was it over here? Yeah, yeah there it is. I don't think this is where the fusions are going to come from. I mean, shouldn't he be down here somewhere? Oh, oh. Is it like tiered? Yeah, it's like tiered. Like you have to fuse heroes to fuse heroes to fuse heroes. Yeah, I think that's him. That's him. That's our guy, right? Yeah, that's him. Th that guy could make torture helm. We're going to feed him. I mean, if we cared about long-term gameplay, which we don't. Uh, yeah. Twenty second in tournament. Does that mean I can get like a reward out of this already? Like for not even playing tournaments? See how they're just giving stuff away? Not enough tournament points earned. I have... Where am I? 
14. Oh, okay, it'll be a bit before I get the five summon shards. Ooh, we think we can do it before the end of stream. Arena. Clan bosses. The Doom Tower. Doom music intensifies. All right, boss stage. Can we handle Mr. Lizard Man? Find out next time on Raid Shadow Legend Z. But I'll be honest with you. I, I, the reason why I decided to do this now is one, because it's while well, the bell's away season. And I wanted to do something wacky and different. But also, I get like three emails a week from various mobile games asking me to play it on stream. And they're all like, you could earn up to X amount of money if, with people on your stream sign up. And it's always like 20 people. Have you not checked my streams? I don't have 20 people watching, let alone 20 people to sign up. And I know some of you are like, well, we'll make alts and get you the money. Don't! I don't want this to work. I want this to fail so they stop doing it. the lizard men tainted by the shadow, the company waylaid a messenger bearing a missive from the king. They demanded that he direct them to the royal encampment. Trembling for his life, the emissary pleaded that he knew nothing of such a camp. He had only ever received the sealed messages from a hooded knight at the catacombs of the Temple of Narbok. <coughs> Emerging from the sewers, the company set their compass northeastward and began a long and arduous trek. To the catacombs. Are we just gonna keep going deeper in the ground? Sewers, catacombs, lava. Classic arena. Oh yeah. I want to get beaten by some whale who spent too much money. Skip. Oh, we got a full set of life gear. And an attack helmet and some more stuff. Cool. Hey uh cleric lady, you want you want some you want some more life armor? Hey, you have a full set of life armor. And have some life boots. All right, there you go. We'll uh, we'll uh, we'll upgrade all of these too. Level four. Oh, hey! Oh, these are epic versions of them. Oh, that's pretty cool. See. Just there, it like tickled the back of my brain that made me want to like do this game. I was like, oh, I could get epic, just get epic gear, and then it gives you all these extra. Stop it! I am being exploited as we play. Oh, I'm so exploitable. Did I ever tell you guys that I played cook played quote unquote cookie clicker for like a year and a half, uh, and then came back to it later and was like, oh yeah, we'll do more of this. Defense one. Oh man. Yeah, equip it. Cook. Well, you click a cookie and you get a cookie. Ah, uh, and then you click it again. You know the cookie. And you get enough cookies, you can buy a clicker that will click for you. And then you get enough clickers, you can buy a grandma that'll bake cookies for you. And then, and then, and then. Then. And then you just get lost in it. Number go up, and that was good enough for me at the time. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. That's right. But yeah, I'm a sucker for these sort of things. That's why I like like factory games. Like I played the last like two months, I've played a lot of Satisfactory in my free time. And uh, uh, yeah, I like I like number go up kind of games. And yeah, the, uh, certain RPG elements appeal to me for that. And this is why I got so addicted to fucking. Um, FGO, right? Number go up. Number go up, feel good. Yeah. 
I don't mean to be like that guy, but what the fuck? Stop asking me for money! Oh, we got some magic brews. Nice. Cool. Use cookies to get more cookies. Yeah, that's all it is. Cookie, cookie, make cookie, which means more cookie. So, yeah, that just... Yeah, we have more silver than when we started, just from all the quests finishing. Bonkers. But I don't have any champions to feed. Huh. But I do have a skill tome. Hey, Sniper, I like you. Can I skill tome you? Cool. That had like no no like whoosh energy behind it. It's like, yeah, it's what the hell? Why is this icon changing? Oh, because what it's a different we want money from you thing. I fell for it, just changing the icon. The icon changed again. Wow. The brimstone path is where this all ends, it looks like. Good, good campaign, good campaign. All right, Catacombs of Narbuk. At last, but, they at arrived last at we've Narbuk, arrived. Where the at, temple was yeah. now consecrated to the cult of Siroth. Uh, cult of Siroth? That's, that's better than the shadow. Guided by their torches, they entered the catacombs where the wind howled with the anguished screams of the restless dead. As they sank deeper into the vaulted galleries, a voice on the wind became ever more distinct, now echoing words of protest, now prayers to Lamea, the goddess of Lamea. light. Lamea. All right. Uh, oh yeah, look at this. We got like a demony girl and some more zombie boys. Let me guess. Yeah, beat stage. Yeah, okay. All right. Green, purple, green, blue. Still no five hero setups, eh? Take the mage killer along. Give her some XP. We'll mix it up. In fact, we we still have some gear laying around still, right? Why Elaine doesn't have a full set of gear? I'm sorry, Elaine. Besides, Ranger's level 10 anyway. She can't get any more XP. All right, let's go. Let's go. Ooh. Ooh -woo. Hey, chat. What's the name of this game again? Is it not working? Is the chat is the chat filler chat filter too sensitive? <laughs> Lame slotho lazy bones. Lame slotho lazy bones. Okay, take it easy there with the with the aggression. Yeah, yeah, it still works. I guess it's just a question mark that, uh, that does. Yeah, mm -hmm, there he is. Yeah, okay, yeah, okay, it works. It works. All right. It's just too sensitive on this on the question mark. <laughs> Got it. <clears throat> so, so I put that in there. Too. Oh, ah! <laughs> yep, it works.
Thank you, tits. Wait, are we healing up between encounters? Is that what the War Priest is doing? Wow, she's valuable. Uh oh, uh oh, oh, Ranger's down. Oh, we got a hat with a different set bonus. Interesting. Uh, let's replay that again. Duck set bonus. Yeah, no. Why are you playing Rage Sword once unsponsored? Why not? Ah! <laughs> okay, so then we... Yeah, we get a little healing after each round. Look at that. Hey, we did it without even dying this time. Yay. Oh, we got a summon shard. Perfect. Back to the Bastion. It's time to... Get our gotcha fix. Please stop asking me for money. I know I know you're offering me chickens and I need chickens, but I'm not paying for chicken. I'm a cook. I can make chicken. Let's see. What are we going to get? Oh, hi. Wind talker of the skinwalkers. Nice skull stick, boy. And you got a skull hanging off your belt. You're really skulltastic. Uh, I like I like the texture stretching on your belt. Do that thing where you stand up again so I can see your clearly not metal belt stretch as you move. Yeah, there we go, like that. Oh yeah, stretch those textures. Remember the little promo you're supposed to read? People are like, look at how beautiful the textures are. They're passable. Oh, yeah, we need a chicken or a duplicate. Darn. Oh, hey, look at that. They got a meme. They got a meme there. Oh, you can't lose the game if you pay to win the game. Tap, tap. Give me 40 bucks. <laughs> fucking, fucking fuck. Is there like a 10 times option here? No, you can... Oh, wait, 6 out of 30. Is there a limit time option you can do this? Ah! Haha, -ha, meme. Very funny. I know, right? Hello, fellow children. Do you like the epic memes? Would you like to play uh, a meme game with us? Watch Call the Arbiter. Share each episode of views and earn rewards. The Arbiter's also hidden codes within each episode. Can you crack them all? Are you serious? Do you, oh. Oh, it, you asked me for money again. Ooh, tavern pack. Woo! Let's try the dungeon again. Green dungeon, go! Oh, you're already here. Who's not in the team? War priest. There we go. Need another one star here to upgrade her? Yeah, I guess so. Or a duplicate, I think. What a waste of lightning arrow. All right, all five fighters made it to the final fight this time. Can we out DPS this bitch's healing? Okay, her guards are down. It's just her. Re she revitalized her pee.
I think we're doing more damage each turn than she's take or healing. Yay. Look at us go. Yeah, revitalize P yourself now. We got her. And it didn't really give us much of anything interesting. Okay. Uh, is there a next? I don't want to go next. Cool. Ah! You need to turn off Raid Shadow Legends forever? Why you gotta be like that, Amajiki? I'm having a good time. Let's do the blue dungeon. You seem emotionally invested in this game not being allowed to continue. What's, uh, boss guide? Seriously? Yeah, you just click go. Not the P, I know, right? Next level P. Not boon of speed. Yeah, waste all your time buffing. You're not going to live long enough to use them. The cleric killed you. Oh, ah! Been through ray. Oh, wait, yeah. Do you have revitalizing P as well? Why are you still alive? Thank you. Ow. Oh, he has a P-Shield. Okay, P-Shield's down. Hit him. Am I actually having fun? No, I'm just sort of waiting for things to be finished. <laughs> well, that's what gotcha games are about. At least the ones I've played. It's design a team with the tools you have based on the luck and or money you have. And then watch that team do the thing. Okay, cool. We beat. Oh, we unlocked a great hall. It's an okay hall. Skip. We got some more booze, though. That's that's a thing. All right, so we did the blue and green dungeons. Stop asking me for money. Let's try the third, the red dungeon. It's a void dungeon, an arcane dungeon. Huh. <laughs> Can I borrow five dollars? No. It's like that bit from South Park. He came out and asked me for about tree fitty, and then I realized it's the god dang Loch Ness monster again asking me for money. Mage Hunter just sort of like weakly like walks up and gives a little stab. Everyone else is like whipping out these magic arrows. Well, they got some chonky boys to guard this time. Stab. Oh, vines. Subjugate. Excuse me. I'm not into that. These are some debuffy boys. Can you not debuff me so much? Thank you. Oh, he's got a flaming stick. I wonder what he's, his P does. I bet it's attack P. Oh, is it debuff P? Oh, it's definitely debuff P. He's waving his stick! Oh, that... Oh, shit, stuns. Is it stun P? We're no longer going to live through this. Oh, yeah. No, that's not good. Uh-oh. Cleric! Cleric seems to be very strong against this guy. Uh, we might be able to just out-tank him at this rate. <laughs> this is ridiculous. His B is too powerful! Debuff P, the worst P. 
But he's not healing and he has no shield. We're going to wear him down eventually. Uh, but I'm just worried about War Cleric's ability to tank him that long. Oh yeah, there goes Archer. Eleanor! Never mind, I think we got this. Yeah, one more round. Good night. I'm the cleric and I'm the best in the world. Such a powerful stream, but after all, this is just me. What do I think of South Park? It was all right. We had a Canadian version of South Park called Chili Beach, uh, which was like, all right. Uh, it was okay. Oh, an archer with one eye. Okay. I bet you're really good at shooting. Uh, can I feed you to my elf? Yep. Uh, hold on. Back the bus up. Did she just go back to level one? Uh, well, you're going to eat the horrible demon guy. Ah, uh, because I don't like him. Uh, and then have two boos? Yeah. Alright, and you you're gonna you're gonna lock up here again on me soon, so you'll need you'll need somebody to Stop asking me for money! Huh. Game's like you if you got a few bucks, I could use a few bucks. You need gloves. Do we have any healing gloves? Set defense. Oh, just a straight defense set. Uh, well, I have no spots for that really, so have a good day. But yeah, South Park is like small town America from the perspective of four kids. Um... And, and eventually, the more stories became about the adults because as the writers aged, so too did their tastes. Um, but Chili Beach was st started with, like, adults. Uh, and it was, like, small-town Canada. And there was, like, this French-Canadian guy who ran the shitty diner and sold a lot of poutine. There was, the, there was a pair of hosers who were like, Hey, man, let's go get drunk, eh? Totally, yeah, let's go, eh? Um... There was the American ambassador and her daughter who was always threatening to sue people and uh, was appalled at the communist healthcare system. Who else was there? I forget who else was in the show. It was a really wacky show. Still no five-team setup, eh? Well, you're all level 10. You guys are getting pretty serious in there. Let's go. Yeah, serious. I've contemplated going back and watching it again, but I don't know if it would... I mean... I remember it, like, vaguely. I don't know if it's, like, worth uh, going back to check out. It might be just really, like, oh, really? That's what I used to like? I guess it's time to be ashamed of my past again. Skelly boy's got some sturdiness to him. Not enough. Hey, we got Skull Squire. You found it, Chili Beach? Nice. Welcome to the team, Skull Squire. I'll probably use you to limit break someone. Next. Oh, it's like a, a Zombride? A Banshee. Hold on. Banshee. Can I show that on Twitch? Probably. Uh, the low, the low resolution—not low resolution—the low effort of that top makes me sad for her. Your fan service without the effort, and her legs clip through her dress when she spins. High quality graphics, nonetheless. How about this one? You just—you just a woman with your butt out. I don't know why, why, and. Eh? 
Like, this guy looks modeled better than those two women. Uh, because his armor actually has to be armor. Whatever. Start. TNA, yeah, I guess. Gotta sell this game somehow. Hey, lonely boys, do you want to get a PNG of a cute, a cute lady who will, who will fight for you? Have we got the game for you? Oh, there's the Banshee lady. Why are you only level five? The last, the last round had level ten final round. All right, all right, whatever, it's fine. Next, next. Oh, this guy's got insane eyes. Look at him. Oh, man. He's seen some shit. De Wait, level 60. Oh, level 7. Okay. And this guy here. Oh, Zelota. He Six stars. Nice gemstone, bro. Hold on. When you move, is that gemstone going to stretch with your chest? I think I see it. Yeah, it distorts as he moves. Mm. Textured, textured armor. Genshin Impact be like, yeah, I know. I can't help but notice each of these zones seems to introduce us to a faction. Like the last zone was the Lizard Man, this one is the Undead, the first one was the uh the Knights Templar or whatever. Interesting. Does that mean there's gonna be like there's 12 levels? Are there 12 factions? The barbarians will be out in the waste somewhere. <gasps> summon crystal. What's that? Are we gonna summon it? Stop asking me for money! Privilege pack! The privilege of spending money, no doubt. Rank 5 chicken available for purchase. Would you like a rank 5 chicken? Hi! Oh! A Barbarian Dervish. Two-star. Another archer. She reminds me of Guild Wars 2's Norn. With the body tattoos? I hope she's tall. What's her lore? Shrouded by the mist of time. Cool. Reviews? 4.6. The best tibbies out of everyone? Ah! about that I mean you got some elf elf tibby dark elf tibby barbarian tibby it's me it's my norn yeah it, yeah it's the blonde it's a blonde norn even yeah blonde norn blonde norn what's she's an attack type 1300 HP at level 1. Attack type 17. Wow, this guy has so much more HP, even though he's level 1 like she is. Hmm. Alright, to the tavern. Uh, you. Upgrade rank. Ah, no suitable chickens. It has to be a 1 star. Oh, we got our points. Oh, we we got some points. Turn it. We're seventh in the tournament. Look at us go. I don't know how we're seventh in the tournament. Five summon crystals. Oh, we actually. Actually, how? Well, let's do some summoning, guys. Let's play a gacha stream. Give me some folks. Hi, Lurker. I don't mean any Lurkers in chat. I'm not calling you out. Uh, it's another Dark Elf. Random dude. Axe Man. I'm an Axe Man. I'm into axes and mans. 
bar uh, barbarian shield guard. Oh, what? Someone is following me. Omo Kiato, welcome, welcome, and thank you for the follow. Hop on board the time machine and get comfy. It's gonna be a good time. Bully. Is bully. They have the Skyrim helmet. Yeah, kind of. A horny helmet. Normally, the horny in Skyrim comes from the, uh, what is word? Uh, the mods. Okay, we got two bullies. Perfect. Off to the tavern. Don't sacrifice the shield guard. Uh, which one's the shield guard? Nope, not what I wanted to do. Shield guard. Uh, we're going to limit break you. Uh, upgrade rank. Take a bully. Become higher rank. There we go. All right. Good job, mage killer. Shield guard is actually pretty good. Uh, well, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry to say, Omo Kiato. Uh, I'm not here to play the game uh, for very long. I'm here to experience... Uh, what the game has to offer uh, and give some commentary on it level 14 I'll take it champion mission progress mission complete I'm just trying it out and pointing out all the exploitative gotcha nonsense it does five hundred thousand that's that's so much to use the M barrel axe man Dervish. Yeah, uh, you can have you can have the bully, you can have the axe man. He's an axe man. And the the, the weird zombie. Give commentary AK shitting on it. I mean look, I can I can acknowledge when it's doing uh things that I know. Yeah, I'm we're leveling booby lady up right now. Boom, leveled. Level five. And I might swap her out for uh, Mage Killer. No, we just unlocked Mage Killer. Shield Guard is good. Uh, he's got a lot of scars on his back. Gets stabbed in the back a lot. But yeah, like I said, I'm just pointing out all the, the sketchy gotcha nonsense it does. Five more summons? Oh, game, you're too kind. Let's do some more summoning. Bit of lag, understandable. I can do a sketchy gotcha. Note. Unfortunately, uh, Omo, uh, I, I understand I have a personality that is easily addicted to things, so I cannot let myself play these games for anything other than a laugh. Uh, if I were ever play this off of stream, I could easily fall into the collector's trap and then I'm spending way too much money on it. And that would uh, destroy me. Hello, zombie man. And we got a bunch of randos. Perfect. Progress mission complete. Oh, are we gonna get some more summons? Cause that'd be that'd be hilarious. No, just more silver. Cool. Keep throwing random things at me. I appreciate it. Yeah, well, it's asked me for money, like, so many times tonight. I'm just like, oh my god, take it easy, game. Oh, this guy's part of a fusion. Look at that. Uh, Alright, Dervish Lady, we're going to feed you some more heroes. Uh, yeah, like... We'll save one of these level ones to limit break you. So you can eat these three. There you go. And I guess we'll go back into the... Oh, no. The battle. No. Champion. We want to give Dervish Lady some gear, too. Hi. Uh, you can have this defense set we've been working on. There you go. Now we can go into battle and we can try her out. The woo. The horn guy is a Giga Chad meme. Really? I, I did not catch that when I was scrolling through. Uh, yeah, we'll take you here. We'll pull out Mage Killer. 
and put in Dervish. I know she's a little low level, but she'll be fine. She'll be fine. Giga Chad meme? I, I'm not seeing it. All I'm seeing is his hair texture awkwardly stretched across his chest and his weird gyrating belt. Remember, in the ad read, they tell you to talk about how great the graphics look. Hey, hold on, before I before I dunk on that again, where's the uh, no, the settings? Okay, no settings. Options, graphic quality. We're on ultra. Ah! Shadow Legends. Look at his icon. Oh, his icon. I mean, maybe. Uh, he is looking at the angle and he does have some facial hair going on. Maybe. I can kind of see it. The helmet guy. Oh, the helmet guy. Oh, yeah, that... Yeah, okay, no. You said horns. I thought it was the one with actual horns, not the horn helmet. But yeah, no, that's pretty Giga Chad. Yeah, I can see the chin now. All right, Poop Lady, let's go. Boom. It's the all archer... No, all, almost all archer team. Oh, look at that horrible bat-looking guy. Disgusting. You're just gonna say it? Ah! Why? Why must you bombard me with things? I'm just trying to have a good time. Well, I'll be removing that redeem after the stream. Raid Shadow Legends isn't always gonna be a thing. Or maybe I should leave it as like a little in-joke. I mean, if I was good at remembering to do things, I would leave it in there as a... Uh, I would change it every time for uh, the name of the game. Is this Dawn of War? You know? Oh, I just want to roll for more heroes. What could we get this time? Ooh, Blady and Giga Chat. Oh, we got the dog. Oh, you poor thing. With all your skin messed up. No, don't do this to your dogs. It's not good. Nicknames. Oh, wow. Nicknames. Alright, let's see how far we can get in the next 30 minutes. Uh, oh, we got a skill book off this one. Level 11 crazy looking zombie guy. Uh, Dervish, you're 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 not you're not up to the task. I'm sorry. We'll level you up somewhere else. Actually, I wonder if there's an auto fill party option. I played I played one game that had a uh, like you could just automatically fill your party with uh, the right elements to win, and then auto battle the game. It's like, why am I even here? You're playing yourself. This guy looks like the little Flesh Reapers from Guild Wars 2 again. Yes, I'm sure you're a very scary boss. Wait, why is my... One of my archers is down. Could you not do that, sir? The company crashed into a chamber to find King Taba strapped to a chair. Oh, his you found the king. forcing a brew down his throat. No, don't make me drink. They made short work of the aggressors, then cut the king from his binds. I have been bewitched. He began in rasping breaths. Oh no! Forced to declare war on Arabia. Then, handing them his royal signet, he said. Ask Queen Eva forgiveness for my forced betrayal. Thank her for giving refuge to my people. 
and request her help to find the cause of this, this shadow. Remember to like and subscribe if you cry every time King, whatever his name is, dies. Oh, we got boots. Nice. Take the boots. There you go, desert lady. Daily quest. We beat a campaign boss. Claim. Does that mean we finished our daily? Daily quest. Yeah, level up. Level up. We have 547 energy out of 57. We are getting energy faster than we can spend it. Dungeon divers event. Ready for our... What? Cool. Swipe down for more. Skyrim. Oh yeah, the the ugly vampires. I I never played with the Dawn Guard uh, ex or expansion on. I only had like the vanilla uh, vampires, which were just like you, but with like red eyes and some fangs. I got this going on. So we can do this without someone dying. Let's get, let's take you out and add you in, uh, and see if that helps us do it without you dying. And then we'll see if anyone else is like level blocked, because that would be annoying. Wow! Look at us fight. Why does everyone want to beat on the the poor mage killer or the ranger? Is it because they're the weak link? Maybe. Hey! You leave her alone. Ow. Ow. Did you know how Banshee spooge me? That's very that's very inconsiderate. Get Valley of Death. There we go. Everyone survived. And we got boots. Hey. What happens when we get... To, can we, like, sacrifice boots to, like... Make more or better boots? What do I do with my excess boots? That's the question I have here. Ah, there's a sell button. Okay. You almost said a bad joke. I'm a cheeky. This is a Christian stream. Please don't make bad jokes here. We're here to 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 be good examples. To all... I I can't keep going with that bit. Just don't get me banned off Twitch. You can say whatever. Unless it bothers someone in chat, in which case don't do that. I don't want I don't want to make anyone feel bad. Anyways, the rules that you clicked yes to when you joined the chat. Basically that. Death hound. Hell hound. Not a hound. Did we complete our collection of low-level elves? We did. Hey, Lurker. All the, all the low-level elves looking pretty weak. Is that everyone? Sylvan Watchers? Oh, oh! They, these don't even have common versions. Rare, epic, and legendary. That's it. They must be new. Cheapers. This is just a spriggan from. Uh... Oh, there's a tree in the background watching us. The the sp no, not spriggans. The tree people from Skyrim. Okay. King Galopcar, dude's jacked. People get paid to design these characters, right? Oh, wow! He, 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 he thick! Yeah, tree people, got it. 
What else we got down here in like the dwarfs? No common dwarves, I imagine, right? Just uncommon. Slicer. He does look like he does some slicing. He also has the uh, Street Fighter guy hair. Flame elementals, yeah. Dwarven chemist. Uh, I don't think that's the right tool for chemistry, sir. Pain Smith. You know what? With a smile like that, I don't know what other job you could get into. Look, are his textures better than everyone else's? Yeah, the chains are actually rendered off of his body. They're not just a texture. Okay, some of the chains are rendered off of his body. Huh. Perforator. Nice crossbow. Nice helmet. Do you think he has three eyes or he just wishes he had three eyes? Can I see inside your third hole? Oh, he's a P skill. For awesome chem, for awesome chem. Ugh, we're gonna we're gonna break this chemical element in half. I don't think that's how that works. The Durham Forest. All to right. gain entrance into Arabia. They would have to pass oh, through the fight dark, dark elves here. to Felwyn's Gate. After a three-day trek, they reached the edge of Durham Forest. Each area is elves. for uh, a specific faction. There we go. The elves promised safe passage to those who would pay the Am toll. I a chemist? I am not a chemist. I'm just a chemical enthusiast. Showing them the signet of the king, the company claimed right of way as bearers of the monarch's word. But the Dark Elves recognized neither king nor queen and attempted to take their toll in blood. So we showed up, they asked for money to travel through the land. We're like, no, look at this ring. Like, no money. And now we're going to kill them all. Rude. Oh, we could get this elf, Spirit Host. I would like to draw your attention to the boobies. And the only thing holding this leather strap on is the fact that it is literally the texture of her skin. There is nothing underneath it. High quality. Uh, all right. Le oh yeah, I wanted to check if. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Are you level locked already, ma'am? No, you can get another twenty levels on you, right? What boobies? Ho oh, ho! I'm a jeeky, rude. Uh, here, eat this. Eat this guy. There you go. Oh, we have a skill book. Who should we get the skill book to? Probably. Hold on. The you, because you have the heal. Which one is the heal? This one is the heal. Divine Light. No, it didn't upgrade up uh, Divine Light. It did upgrade Admonish. That is not what I wanted to do. Fine. Fine. All right, back to the Dark Elf Forest. How dare you make me pay to travel through your lands? Don't you know who I am? I'm a person with weapons. I'm allowed to go where I want. Uh, they're going to absolutely stomp poor Dervish Lady, so we have to level her up the hard way. Well, you know, it's dark in the Dark Elf Forest. See that little text thing in the corner there? Use the name fully upgraded, whatever. That is to design a sense of uh, what is word? Um, envy in other players. Oh look, that guy leveled up his shit. I wish I could level up my shit too. And then they make you want to like compete uh, subtly. Can you not be frozen?
Okay, we're getting a little more pushback on the combat now, even though we have like a level advantage. Uh, this is where like the the need to grind uh, is starting to kick in. I can feel it. I can feel it happening. This is where the game slows down and encourages you to uh, spend some money. Uh, just right into the next battle. Because the rewards are still basic bitch shit. But the XP has slowed down a lot. And I suppose I could be playing these myself rather than just putting on auto battle. Uh, but no. I love committing war crimes. I mean, hey, if that's what you're into in video games. In video games. Hang in there. Thank you. Nobody died again. Yay. We're getting a critical up gear. HP up. What? All right. Next. I mean, I've, I've committed some more crimes in Stellaris. I mean, that game is basically a canvas for you to do whatever you want. And if the game mechanics say, do a thing, I'm going to try a thing out. I can see this devolving into, like, maximum reward per hour kind of gameplay. That's why you have the two times speed modifier here in battle. Level 16, jeez. They're leveling faster than we are. Maybe that's how you get XP, though. Playing this other spot, you better believe it. And we have been talking about all the things it does to manipulate its players, exploit its players, to demean its players, and the way it wastes your time. And the fact that it asks me for money every 20 minutes or so. No, this is unsponsored. I want to be able to say exactly what I think about this kind of manipulative experience. So, yeah, we're here playing some Raid Shadow Legends uh, and discussing what it does. Whenever the option, or not whenever, whenever the uh, game recommends, or uh, not recommends, reminds me that it's doing something shady. Uh, also, welcome, welcome, Echo, and welcome, welcome, welcome. Hope you guys are having a lovely evening, taking care of yourselves, having a good time, playing good games. I'll be honest, I, I have it on auto mode, I just sort of pick which map to go on and the game plays itself. That's how you know a game is good. It can play itself without you. Hey, stop with the... Why are you throwing things at me? Ah. You see, Oneko, the way Raid Shadow Legends makes its money is by targeting a small select group of players who are easily addicted to things. And the game is designed to give you a trickle of things that, that feel like rewards. And then the people that get addicted to those get suckered in. And then they spend money to get more. And it becomes a sunk cost. Like, well, I've already spent money. I have to keep playing. Also, I need to log in every day to get my my uh, my daily rewards. Do my daily quests. And it moves from, from hook to habit. Or from hobby to habit. And those people get stuck playing the game for endless amount of time. They spend so much money. Often to their own detriment. That the game stays profitable. And they can spend $12 million or whatever on advertising, paying everyone and their freaking dog to sponsor this stupid game, and still make money off the whales that they are exploiting. Uh, and then the people that come and go, the minnows that log in, play for a bit, and never spend a cent, they don't care about those people. Fuck them. And the dolphins are people who show up, spend a bit, and then they put it down, or they never come back, or whatever. And they're just sort of icing. They're a little gravy on top. But yeah, it's uh, the the business side of it, which I understand from some business courses and, of course, reading up and watching gotcha game development type stuff. Uh, it really unpacks just how brutally, brutally exploitative this whole thing is designed to be. From the color of the notification symbol 
to the sound of the level up. It's all designed to be like a little Skinner box for you. Click a click a click a click a. Yeah, it's brutal. Um, yeah, it's nasty. But you know what isn't nasty? You know what's delightful? You know what's amazing? Coming this summer, a new Belle outfit splashes onto the scene as she tries to conquer her greatest fear. New games, new redeems, new penalties, all with a whole new look. Coming for your viewing pleasure in late July. Don't miss it. It's going to be a good summer. Yeah, the lovely Sweet Southern Belle has a bit of a bit of a special summer lined up for you all. Uh, much like I am kicking off the while well, the bells away, the senpai will play for the next few weeks. We'll be doing some extra gaming, extra streaming, extra uh, senpai available for the next few weeks. Look forward to that. That was the best segue I've had in ages. Look at me go. <laughs> We'll just let the game keep playing itself. Uh, but yeah, I figured about three hours would be around the time where the uh, the game slowed down and forced you to grind. And yeah, I can feel it. It's coming. It's coming. Bell's greatest fear, new games. Actually, the fear is not the games, but rather the subject matter of those games. <clears throat> A little thalassophobia, anyone? Thalassophobia. Thalassophobia refers specifically to the fear of great depths. And sharks. Ooh, we got a summon crystal. Ooh, quickly go summon. Yay, summon. What the fuck? Why is there a yellow icon here now? Do we get a dog? Why is there a yellow coming? Fragment summon. Oh, we unlocked a new fragment summon. I don't need, I don't need fragments. Go away. I think. I don't have any fragments. It's not water. Subnautica is... Uh, is on the is on the docket. Look forward to that. Stalker. Nice lizard boy. Cool. Mega Hydro Thalassophobia. Ah! Big Deep Water. Good, more money. Freaky shit under the ocean, yeah. Megalophobia has always been an, like an interesting concept to me. Like, fear of things that are large. Crit rate, defense. You already have that. All right. All right, we have some gems uh, that we earned from the game. Can we spend them on anything? Where is the gem shop? These are all ways to get money. Yeah, there's a gem shop. Here it is. Okay. XP boost, energy, small shard pack, demon lord key, name changer, potion pack, big shard pack, Arena refill. So the only thing in here that I would be even tempted to buy is the small shard pack for more summons. Uh, and I don't even have enough gems for it. I don't know what any of the rest of this stuff does. Well, the potions we know upgrade uh, skills. That's also very expensive. Yeah, they give you just enough to be like, ooh, I can almost get that. I should buy some, I should buy some gems. That's another way they get you, and it's pure business sense. So say something costs uh, 900 gems, and they sell gems in lots of 500 or 1,000. So 
you buy the thousand gems, you buy your 900 gem item, and you have a hundred gems just left laying around. And part of you is like, I want to spend that last hundred gems. So you look, and there's something there for like 150 gems. So you're like, okay, I'll buy another little small thing of gems, or I'll wait to earn some of it. Then you always have a few gems left over, so you always feel like spending them. Yeah. Yes, the Raid Shadow Legends ads are accurate. They do indeed feature rendered characters running down a hallway blasting things with skills but yeah the bar pulling game oh my god I, ah! thank you i'm a jiki uh yeah i watched an expose on that someone actually downloaded that game and played it to see what it was like not even close to the stupid puzzle solving thing it's nuts it's absolutely nuts how the advertising isn't even close it's not even close When do I get a five-person party? Psychologue, I, I know! They intentionally do the puzzles wrong to make you want to play it right. Again, good marketing. Shady, but good. Yeah, yeah, they also just recycle their advertising. Elven Blade! Elven Blade! Elven Blade! Can you stop Elven Blading me? This is... Wow. Really? Okay, we're done. All right, let's fight the boss. Level 18. Uh, well, I don't have any better heroes than this, so Alan Z once more into the into the fray. Oh, he did not die. Oh, he died anyways. Oh. Some real meaty levels now. Look at that. I'm look, Ma. I'm playing with no hands. There's so little to do while I'm doing this game. I feel like I'm getting fidgety. Like I want to like check my phone or like play with my fidget cube. Oh, our first dragon. Trading card games are just physical gotchas. Okay, all right. I'm going to agree with you there, Oneko, but with one key difference. If I get a good hero in this game, and I don't want to use them, I can't trade that to another player for a hero I do want. I can't sell that to a trading card game shop to get money. Once I have a hero, all I can do is burn them the ugly truth or the dark use elves them. Was now known. Trading card games... If I get something I don't want, I can trade it or get money for it. In a gotcha game, once I have something, it is against the terms of service to trade it or get money, or even just impossible. Uh, I'm, when I finished with FGO, when I finally said I was done, I sold my account to another player. Because my account was a day one account with a perfect login streak and... Every hero unlocked except for two, all of which were max level. It was a really good account. And I didn't want to just scrap it, so I sold it. And you know what I did with that money? I bought my VTuber model. And yeah, trading card games are gambling for children. You just said that. It's gambling for children, right? You, you, oh, do I get the shiny? Do I get the foil, etc. But the difference lies with the fact that if a child's parents or a child comes to the realization that this is not for them, they can recoup some of the cost. They still made the mistake, but they can undo part of the mistake. Again, people who are not prone to addictive behavior can play these things, drop in, drop out, use whatever they get, just go buy certain cards off of a secondhand market and not deal with the randomness, whatever, right? There are ways to engage with these things. Um, 
that are are healthy and and decent but a lot of people don't engage with them in a healthy or decent way um, but yeah the the ability to cash out is a very important part of real life gaming uh, casinos are the same way too, right? There's always the option to go, all right, I'm done and get your money and go home. But a lot of online games, it's like, okay, you won. Your money will be here when you get back. You can't cash out. And yeah, so, some games allow you to sell them through third parties. CSGO is a good example. Uh, KDOG sold a MechWarrior account. Yeah, against Terms of Service. They don't want other people to get stuff that you earned. Because... If they can buy stuff from other people, once it's earned, it becomes tradable, and that makes it less valuable to the company to get new players in. Because if you can just hop in on someone else's account, you don't have to get a new account. You don't have to pay the premium. You don't have to do whatever. You can just have something nice. And that's why these games aren't about having something nice. They're about getting money out of their audiences. So yeah, the Preying elves. On the desperation of the refugees, they had offered two. Yeah, paths. the elves are evil. What a surprise! They're dark elves. The rich man's path, offering safe passage to Felwyn's gate, and the poor man's path, leading to the belly of the dragon. Well, we killed the dragon. The company least. blazed ahead to meet the elven queen of Aravia, an ancestral ally of Kirok. Known for her exceptional beauty, she was also a famed mistress of the. Oh look, dragon. a hot elf queen. What do you know? So our heroes joined the torrent of hopeful exiles traveling eastward to the promise of sanctuary among the high elves. <laughs> Legit. <laughs> oh, not that kind of high? Anyways. But yeah, the, the, there's a lot of gambling in these games. So much gambling in these games. We got some new business down here. What are these? Divine Offense. Attack and 15 HP on shield self for three turns. Wow. And we got a crit rate part of a set. Yeah, there's just a lot of... Yeah, the items are starting to pile up and they all have different rarities. And yeah, the system is designed to take a long time. Uh, and yeah, the, once the time is invested, they've got you in that psychological trap of I've invested the time. I want to see where this goes. Because right now, even playing this game on purpose to debunk it part of me is like well i wonder how the story ends i mean it's only another another eight levels but the levels are going to get harder and you're going to need to grind more heroes and do more summons and all these things that are just going to sink my time and beg me for money and i i can't I can't. It's not healthy for me. It's not healthy for most people. Again, there are some people that can engage with these things on a healthy level. They, they're not susceptible to it. They drop in, drop out. They just do their thing. But so many people... Oh, I can scroll this screen? Neat. So many people just can't help it. And they just get stuck. And it's bad for them. Arcades start gambling addictions. I mean... Yeah, here's the thing. It's not always a gambling addiction. There's a fella at work. He buys a lottery ticket uh, once a week. He just goes in, picks up a ticket, just asks for random numbers, just a little little trinket along with his like his weekly purchases of other stuff. And that's fine. If he's running short or whatever, he just doesn't do it. It's a little trinket of entertainment for him. But some people, they buy those things all the time because they're going to save them from their predicament when really part of their predicament is buying that shit over and over again, right? It's Human psychology is too easily exploited. And I just... Unlock? Uh... Uh... Yeah. So yeah, it's, it's, it's a whole thing. It is a whole thing. And we've... Se okay. I don't need the keyboard anyways. Don't move the mic. You're still talking. So, what do I have to say about Raid Shadow Legends? It is a painfully generic gotcha game in the in the category of mass-produced gotcha games. The, the interface looks the same. The pop-ups are the same. The little city is the same. The heroes are all like, okay, yeah, look at these heroes. Whatever. Who cares, right? The, the models aren't as good as they say. The gameplay is not gameplay. If you're into collection games and you can pick this up and put it down, 
go for it. But are there better things I think you could do with your time? Absolutely. There are better gotchas and better games out there. There are gotchas that have better looking characters, gotchas that are involve characters from other properties that have actual backstory, gotchas that might actually have a story that's interestingly written. This is the most generic way to get money out of people I have ever seen. I, I would say uh, Genshin Impact is probably the best gotcha because it has actual gameplay uh, and in, in, in a fairly un, a fairly interesting world. And uh, and yeah, the, the characters are actual characters instead of stat sticks. Because we played for, what, we played for three hours? What do we know about any of these people? They don't, some of them don't even have names. Oh yeah, watch out for watch out for Mage Killer or Sniper. It's all hollow. It's all nonsense. You want to collect elf titties? Collect elf titties. You want to collect barbarians? Go collect barbarians. Fine. That's all it's about. That's all it's about. Um, and yeah, I mean, I just don't think there's no meat on these bones. It's just it just keeps asking me for money. I much prefer, I much prefer games that maybe aren't as widely popular, but that there's something interesting about them. <coughs> and yeah, all the design elements are just there to encourage you to stick around longer, spend more time, and eventually spend money. Like, look at this. I, I'm, I'm ranked sixth in this tournament somehow. Did I get another reward out of it? Probably not. But it made me click it because it told me I'm sixth. Yeah, look at that. I got 93 points. Oh, just seven more points. I can get 50k more silver. And if I get that silver, I could do... What can I do with that silver? Who knows? It's just... It's breadcrumbs leading you to the shop. Would you like to spend some money? Look at all these packs you can buy. This is nuts. 21 bucks. $56 Canadian... Okay. 21, 14 is going to be 35. 35, another 21 would be uh, 56. 50, $60 even. 100 bucks. 107. 121. 161. 182. 203 dollars for the limited special officers not to mention all of these oh bank expansions oh no this is a currency exchange i can get silver for gems 4.2 million silver great skill tomes yeah More packs here. Yeah. It's hundreds of dollars. Hundreds for a free game. Yes, I saw Ross's game dungeon. Uh, I have it in my watch later list. I'll probably watch it tomorrow while I'm doing uh, audio work. Hey, <laughs> Ross's game dungeon. Always a good time. Hashtag not sponsored. Nothing on this stream is sponsored. All right. So we're going to we're gonna say goodbye to Raid Shadow Legends. Do you want to exit the game? We're never going to see this again. Everyone's wave goodbye. Wave goodbye. It's gone now. Except Bellstream. Ah! <laughs> I'll never be free from this pain. All right. So that's the unsponsored stream. I'm going to take a quick drink here and do the ad read one more time. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, oh, the barrage! The barrage! The pain! This is how many times the game asked me for money. Officially represented on screen. <laughs> Why? Why do you guys have to be like this? Fucking brutal. Ugh. 
<laughs> I'm sorry, I'll never play a gotcha again. Bruh. Bruh. Okay, alright. <clears throat> well played. I'm gonna drink. I'm gonna do the ad read one more time. The bears of the $70 packs. And then we'll do a raid. Easy. Get off my head. Alright. <clears throat> Ad read. Bruh. Today's stream is not brought to you by Raid Shadow Legends, one of the best advertised gotcha playing experiences of 2021. And it's technically free. Currently, almost 10 million suckers have downloaded Raid over the last six months, and it has one of the most impressive trailers in its class, with deceptive footage, meaningless environments, and an irrelevant 60 frames per second. All the champions in the game need to be customized with randomized gear that limits your strategies based on your luck. The dungeon bosses have some ridiculous HP totals, and spending enough time and money to deal with that damage is meaningless. Currently, with over 300k reviews, Raid has paid for an almost perfect score on the Play Store. The community is constantly in turnover aside from a few whales, and the new Faction Wars feature is now live. You will not find my squad in its unbalanced arena. It's easier than ever to start with rates with the rates program for new players. You get low value daily rewards for the first 90 days, 90 days to make this game a habit instead of a hobby. So what are you waiting for? Go to the video description. Do not click the links and do not click the special links because 50k silver is a meaningless amount of currency, which is why it gets given out. You'll miss out on a substandard epic champion to start your journey. Good luck on your gacha rolls and I hope to never see you playing this awful game. That is Raid Shadow Legends. Close. All right. So, my friends, thank you all for hanging out. Thank you for enjoying this time. If you enjoyed this time. Did you enjoy this time? I know I didn't want to do the full four hours on that because... Oof. But I did want to do the unsponsored stream. Do a little Duncan. Say, say my piece, you know? Uh, you alright there, stream? Yeah, you're good, you're fine. Alright, so let's find somebody to raid. Let's pop in and pass on some positivity now. We're purging the negativity. Raid is behind us. We're going to find someone playing a decent, a good, a delightful game. Tomorrow, tomorrow we'll be playing Terra Nil which is a game about terraforming a planet ravaged by industry. It should be delightful. Why are we still throwing Raid Shadow Legends piles at me? Yes, yes, we'll bring up bring up the bring up the promo. Pictures. I should have this in the overlay somewhere. Stop! Stop! Why? Why must you raid legend me? I can't. I'm dying. Display capture. All right. So, while well, the bell's away, the Senpai will play. Starting today, we did the legendary unsponsored stream. Uh, and then tomorrow, we'll be playing Terra Nil. And then on Wednesday, we'll be starting Dawn of War Soulstorm. Uh, and then we'll have the anime roundup on the Discord. Uh, we will not be playing Stellaris. We'll instead be doing Into the Abyss, or Surviving the Abyss. Surviving the Abyss. Uh, on the, uh, So, yeah, we finished Stellaris already, so there. And that'll be a week one, finishing up with uh, another Soulstorm and Xenonauts. Yes, if you didn't notice, the schedule on the Discord is packed full of jam. Uh, we got lots of cool streams and events happening here for a little bit. So look forward to a whole bunch of extra Senpai. Isn't that what you wanted? Is this not what you desire? More content? Hashtag content? Yeah, Raid Shadow Legends. Uh huh. Uh, 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 I need to figure out why it double does some of my redeems. That's good. D 
Deep Rock Galactic, eh? Oh my goodness. You found another one of the redeems that has the uh, has the, the toss on it. Very nice. I should get that tossed to me again soon if they're messed up the same way. Are you wrapping up? Darn, they're wrapping up. I thought we could raid Jeffy Bed. They're a Canadian alien. But they are wrapping up, it seems. Darn. Cloudy Pistachio is playing... Oh, League of Legends. Gross. Uh, Dead by Daylight. Legend of Zelda. Botwa. Kadu is playing the Long Dark. And they'll be right back. I wonder how long it'll take them for be right back. Uh, a can alien? Yes, a can alien. Wait, did I, oh, I didn't share. I didn't screen share that. Yeah, okay. Oh, is Kado back? Kado is back. All right. They're playing the Long Dark? No, are they done playing Long Dark? They're playing Valorant now. Ugh. No, play Long Dark. It's good. They're just screen sharing their, their whole ass Steam right now. I'm going to unmute him, see what he's up to. Yeah, let's just drop on him. He's, he's figuring things out, but he's still going. All right, so we're going to drop in on Kadu. Kadu has been streaming for six, six, seven years. They've been at it for ages. They're they're real dialed into internet meme culture. All right? Drop in, say hi, all right? Do you think the Riot fan thing will detect me if I do this? I want to do a thing where I set it up so that Chat can play Valorant. Ooh, here, watch. <laughs> We, we guys chat let's do a test run let's do a test run let's do a test run okay. senpai raid all right slash let's, raid let's do, let's do a little test kadu run. Little of, yeah um, the there we go coding. Coding so using, um, i'll be back tomorrow uh, for terra nil and wednesday okay. for dawn of war soul storm both guys, gonna be guys, uh guys. good time good time um so that's where i'll be thank you all for coming by thank you all for hanging out while i did my unsponsored content hashtag don't play raid uh i hope you had fun with the 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 tits on stream uh that was fun to set up and it worked almost completely what is right uh so you know where i am you know what we're doing but if i don't see you there wherever you are whatever you do have a good time and then we need to do what copy and then paste Paste, paste, paste. All right. Uh, we're gonna edit the keyboard. This is gonna be W, and I'm gonna add the trick trigger. And this is going to be ah, hi senpai, how's it going, mate? And this is gonna be how do we how do we simulate walking forward, guys? How should we simulate walking forward? What do you guys want to say when you guys walk forward? Because forward seems too much. What if I just say a cum? Okay.